I saw a young man who stepped on the mat with the intention of winning his match. And once he realized the situation, he encouraged his competitor with verbal prompts. I think that he was in it to be competitive, but also to be um, compassionate. The young man from Massac would become stressed easily. So as his Massac teammates were encouraging him, he kept repeating, I can't, I can't, I can't. And the young man from Stratford High School just would speak to him calmly and say, you know, keep trying, keep trying, keep going, give it your best effort. And um, those types of positive comments were made throughout. It was especially, he just kept encouraging the young man. You could see just the nonverbal behavior that the young man was like, oh, okay, I'll just keep going. And so, and as a result of that, he would score a reversal or, or score a handful of points. He started running towards the Stratford side of the mat, and then he turned around and he went back to the Massac side of the mat, and of course he gave his, his pose. It was a, a beautiful situation to witness. The last 10 seconds were very emotional for Giuseppe, and, and again, you know, being so close to what was going on, I don't think other people would have been able to observe that, but he had tears in his eyes. It was an emotional moment for him. I don't think he understood the gravity of the gift that he gave everybody that evening in the gymnasium. When you make sacrifices like Giuseppe did, I think it just rises to a level that many athletes that participate in team sports don't get to experience.